Hi, and welcome to ZTech News. I'm Johnny Z, and today we're going to be talking about RGB your system or RGB everything. Um, if you haven't known already, and you probably know already, and you probably have your system set up, is that one of the biggest, actually the biggest uh, trends now in the computer industry or the PC industry or build your own system industry is that modifying and customizing your system with all kinds of colors and RGB stuff in your machine is one of the biggest trends going right now. I, for one, when I first started off at checking out all the RGB stuff, very skeptical. I thought, no way am I going to do that in my system. Well, guess what? <laughs> I did. I added an NZXT uh, liquid cooler with their fancy go-around thingy. Um, I added a, a bunch of white fans at the top of the case and red fans in the front to give it sort of a, a nice little contrast. Plus my graphics card, which is an RX 570 uh, Sapphire Nitro Plus with the word Sapphire in a Sapphire color. And the cool thing about this is that <clears throat> not only can you set these colors depending on what your motherboard uh, you know, the motherboard uh, allows you to customize, you can do different colors, you can do, uh, you know, so many colors is not even funny. There's 1.6 million colors that you can choose from on some of the uh, uh, some of the aspects. Corsair, for instance, has fabulous um, uh, fan, uh, case fans that can do multiple RGBs that flash in different colors. Uh, do all kinds of pulsing and breathing styles, which is just fantastic looking. I mean, um, the Corsair 570X case, all glass, top, both sides, and once you RGB the, the crap out of that system, it will look beautiful. And that's the good thing about it. That's the most exciting thing, is now you can customize your system, build it the way you want to build it, and show it off. I mean, it's not a boring beige box anymore like back in the 90s or even in the early 2000s. It's not a boring black box anymore. Now you can get cases with uh, with different colors. You can get cases with RGB built right into them already, which you can customize and, and do whatever with that. So we're at this new part of the PC industry, which is really, really exciting. I mean, it's a lot of fun to go out and say, okay, I want to, you know, adds a splash of color to the front of my machine. You can do that, no problem. Get, you know, just red fans, white fans, or get the RGB fans that you can control through software and just beautify the machine. I mean, it's it's to the point now where it's just, you can't let you get your eyes off of the machine. Uh, I mean, it's amazing. Uh, just take a look at this. So right there, you can see my Sapphire card my keyboard if you can see my finger in the reflection which is a logitech uh, keyboard it's not rgb but it is lit up uh, there's the nzxt cooler that's just going cycling through different colors the sapphire uh, uh, logo there will breathe up and down and also the cool thing about it is it will change colors as the card heats up uh, the red fans over here and then the white fans on the top which sort of highlights what the, what I wanted to do with the white is highlight the case inside and highlight all the components inside. And then the red just giving it a different sort of a, a gamer look, if you will. And that case is a, a fractal design, a Fusion uh, G, I think it is. Fusion G um, case. And it's actually pretty inexpensive. If you can get it on sale, you can get it around 50 bucks. The, uh, the fractal design cases are really, really well made, well designed. Uh, they're designed by Swedes. In other words, you know, that design uh, sort of knowledge and what have you that made IKEA famous um, is being brought down into PC cases. So it's really, really cool. I, I mean, I really enjoy it. So that's part of it. I mean, I can go a little bit nuts and have these colors here uh, change different colors I haven't these are just static red but I can put RGB uh, fans in there and keep on changing the colors also if you can see a little bit here that RGB strip which is part of the motherboard and there's one right there also which is covered by the graphics card is set to rainbow mode and it's just cycling through various colors 
and it just looks really really cool i mean i really enjoy this type of thing and you know you can sit there it's a hobby within a hobby you build your system and then you beautify it with rgb okay now uh with the whole rgb thing it's actually it's not really all that expensive if you shop around and look around you can get uh, different items for half decent costs. Uh, I find that Corsair tends to be on the expensive side, but they have some really, really well-made stuff. Uh, Deep Cool has some really cool stuff too, which is inexpensive, um, but it you know it depends. Their quality is not super, super great. If you go up to the Deep Cool Gamer Storm stuff, that's a lot better. Um, let's see who else is there uh just about every keyboard manufacturer uh, on the planet um corsair again with their mechanical keyboards have an amazing rgb um uh, let's see who else is there there's cougar there's just about every brand out there even some a lot of the no name excuse me no name brand chinese companies that are coming out with some actually half decent stuff at really good prices are fully rgb fully customizable which makes it, you know, that much more enjoyable. Uh, I, I mean, it's hard to articulate this. Once you see a system designed and built with all the RGB, with LED strips in it, it really makes the machine stand out and really sort of gives you that warm and fuzzy feeling, let's just say, that you built your machine, you built it, it works, it's fast, it does everything you want it to do, plus it looks great. I mean... I mean, that's not, yeah, there's nothing to sneeze about that. So um, when you go to your computer store, there's a ton of RGB stuff. So when you go there, just cruise around, see what you like, get an idea of what you're thinking about doing. Um, don't be close to the idea totally. Uh, some people are, some people just hate it. They don't want it. They just want their black box shoved in a corner somewhere. They don't want to see it out of sight out of mind and that's it but now there's a growing popularity it's growing it's growing so much now that you can get gamer chairs with rbg uh, rgb in it it that's a little overkill in my opinion but if there's a market for it there's a market for it by the keyboard mice uh cases case fans liquid coolers cpu coolers um motherboards especially motherboards motherboards are getting really big into the rgb business now and again it just gives you that more colorful more customized look that you want for your system so take your time at the store see what you like discuss it with your with the sales guy and see you know what they can uh they can suggest to you do your homework on google see how other people have set up their machines i mean you can go full liquid cooling um, and have it all RGB or a single color or whatever, like a white case, white fans, white cool, uh, uh, liquid cooling with the white thing. Yeah, I mean, you can make this look stunning, beautiful. Yeah, you can go a little bit overboard and make it gaudy a little bit, but it's up to you. Whatever you like, do it. If it looks cool, great. That's what's all that matters. Anyways. I'm, jo I'm Johnny Z, this is Z-Tech News, and we were discussing today about RGB goodness. Anyways, take care. Don't forget, bottom of the screen, subscribe to us <coughs> here on YouTube, and follow us on Twitter at Z-Tech News. I'm Johnny Z, and that's it. Take care.